Oh, hey there, guys. Hi. Did you find my friend's dump truck? No, I'm afraid I didn't. Nobody's been able to find it. I'm really sorry, Gobi. Tell you what. You boys go enjoy the rodeo, and afterwards, we'll see what we can do, okay? Okay. Thank you. Come on, Gobi. Let's watch from over there. Now let's put on those hard hats and get this rodeo started. What do you say, Mr. G? I say, yee-haw! Because it's time to haul some dirt with the dump trucks! Like. Yes! Yes, it is! Get ready for El Dodo! Ah! Now, El Dozer's gonna push those piles of dirt into those holes! Yeah, El Dozer! Cool! Hug him! Yeah. Folks, they're going to use the crane to try and grab Gobi's dump truck before El Dozer buries it! We need your help. When the scoop is right over Gobi's dump truck, say, now! Now! My dump truck! These are our batteries. Without them, we can't get the power back on. I need power. Uh-oh. Look! He's almost out of power! That's why he took our batteries. How can we get him power if the batteries don't fit? Oh! We can use... Solar power! But we're gonna need your help. We need to make Buster a hat out of solar panels that can charge up his battery, so he'll never run out of power again. Which of these solar panels fits here? That one! Great! And which solar panel goes here? That one goes there! Right! So this last panel must go here. Now Buster's hat is finished. Thanks for your help. Now we need to get you into the sunlight and charge you up. Quick, before the sun goes down. I'm... I'm solar power! <laughs> wow. wow! He's a great dancer. Cool moves! 
Thank you! Solar power workers, here to help! Yes? Hello. I'd like a home that's just right for me. Well, you've certainly come to the right place. Welcome to Dima's Dream Homes, where we build the home that's just right for you. We have all kinds of homes to choose from. Tall skyscrapers, apartment buildings, houses, huts, you name it. Let's see. I'd like a pink house with three levels and a slide. A pink triple with a side of slide. Wonderful. Here you are. Your perfect home, complete with furniture. Well, that's embarrassing. Uh-oh. No biggie. I'll just need to put them back into the right rooms. Hmm. I wonder where this goes. I need your help. Let's start with the refrigerator. Where does the refrigerator go? The kitchen? The bedroom? Or the bathroom? The kitchen! Yeah, the refrigerator keeps food cold in the kitchen. Now we need to find the right spot for the couch. Where does the couch go? The living room, the bathroom, or the kitchen? The living room! Right, you can sit on a couch in the living room. Hmm, there's only one thing missing. You! <laughs> home sweet home. <laughs> Thank you, it's perfect. You're welcome. And thank you for your help. It's heading straight for Bubble Puppy's doghouse. <gasps> oh my. Oh my goodness. I am so sorry, Bubble Puppy. Oh, that's okay, Stan. It was an accident. Mr. Grouper, Bubble Puppy loves his doghouse. Can we fix it, Mr. Grouper? Well, we may not be able to fix this one. But don't worry. I bet we can build Bubble Puppy a new doghouse, an even better one. Yeah, a new yeah, doghouse? Really? Sure, there are places right here in our neighborhood where we can get everything we need. We can get tools and wood at the hardware store. <laughs> That's right, Nani. And we can get paint at the neighborhood paint store. Yep. Let's think about our neighborhood. Neighborhoods are made up of different places, and the place where you can get your groceries is called the... Supermarket. Right! And the grassy place where you can find a slide or swings is the... Playground. Right! The playground in a park. And the building where you can check out lots of books is called the... Library! Yep! Your neighborhood has all kinds of places you can go. Let's sing about it! Walking down the streets of my hometown There are friendly faces all around At the cleaners and the grocers and the library, yeah Everybody's gonna wave to me hey, hello. The beauty parlor's making everybody look fine The florist and the baker, they're friends of mine hey, Got a whole bunch of playgrounds you can use for free We share it all like a big family Keep my neighborhood All the 
stop signs. And there's the traffic light. Let's get them out of here before Bigfoot comes back. Put him in here. the road here. Huh? It's not safe. Sure isn't. Yeah, that's why I borrowed your signs. Huh? I just wanted to take Patterson swimming in the lake. Patterson? Who's Patterson? Come on out, Patterson. Aww. I couldn't figure out how to get safely across this busy road. That's my stroller. I thought maybe your signs and lights could help, but I don't know how they work. Oh, I'm sorry. You shouldn't have taken them. They help keep everyone in the park safe. But you're right. You and Patterson need to be able to cross the road safely, too. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Oh, yeah! Here you go. Your very own stoplight. <gasps> oh, thank you. That'll stop the cars. Hi, everyone. I'm your host, Jimmy. We're here today in the neighborhood of Bubble Tucky because of a little pup who everyone knows and loves. Gil, what can you tell us about Bubble Puppy? Well, Jimmy, the very first time I saw Bubble Puppy, I knew we'd be best friends. But when his doghouse got wrecked, he was really sad. So we knew we had to do something special for him. Everyone in the neighborhood wanted to help out so we could give Bubble Puppy a big surprise. A really cool new doghouse. <laughs> All right, let's take a look at the video. Bubble Puppy, wait till you see what your neighbors have built for you. We know you love your bubble bites, so Bud and I got you a doggy treat dispenser. I added a police siren. We put in a slide. I think you're going to like it a lot, Bubble Puppy. Awesome. Okay, okay. Everyone get behind the bus. Gil's gonna call Bubble Puppy out here. <laughs> Gil? Bubble Puppy! Come out here, boy. We have a surprise for you. Over here, boy. We have a surprise for you, boy. All right. Please move the school bus.
Bubble Puppy, we built you a brand new doghouse. And everyone in the neighborhood helped out. Your super cool new doghouse comes complete with a ladder, an umbrella, and a slide. But that's not all, Bubble Puppy. Stan? Bubble Puppy, I added a very special surprise for you. <laughs> a shopping cart! <laughs> <laughs> Construction vehicles are cool. What does vehicle mean? A vehicle is something that carries or moves things. That's right. Let's think about different kinds of construction vehicles. The construction vehicle that can push big piles of dirt and rocks is called a... Bulldozer! A bulldozer, right. The construction vehicle that can carry dirt and rocks and other heavy things is called a... Dump truck! Right! Dump trucks carry stuff. And the really tall construction vehicle that can lift heavy things high up into the air is called a... Crane! A crane! That's right! There are also concrete mixers, backhoes, and excavators. And you can find all of these vehicles at a construction site. So there's a job to do, a pretty big one too. You might need help, it's true, from a machine or two. You need to dig a hole for, say, a flagpole, or something bigger yet. A basement? No sweat. Sorry, <laughs> it's kind of a mess in here. Wow, amazing. Look, that's a picture of the sun, and it's being blocked by the moon. And there are spaces for two more pictures. Oh, yeah. Well, that'll tell you when the eclipse is going to happen. You just got to put the rest of the pictures in order. If you can uh, find the pictures, We need to find two more pictures. Do you see any pictures? Right there. There are two pictures. Great. Let's put them in order. We need your help. Let's put the pictures of the moon blocking the sun in order. This picture is of the moon completely blocking the sun. It goes last. So which one of these pictures comes first? This one or this one? This one. The moon isn't blocking the sun. Right. And this picture shows the moon starting to block the sun. It goes here. There. The pictures are in the right order to show a solar eclipse. Thanks for your 
help. It's showing us how the eclipse happens. Cool. Wow. That big ball is the sun. And that's the Earth and the moon going around the sun. Look, the moon made a really big shadow on the Earth. So that's how it gets dark during the day. It's a really big shadow. But when's it going to happen? That's fun. <laughs> oh, that means it's today. Today? Well, what do you know? We need to get back to the sun, people. Yeah, and you should probably hurry. Where are we going? Through the jungle. But the jungle tracks aren't finished yet. But we don't have a choice. Okay, but we have to watch out for broken tracks. fits on the tracks. This one, or this one? This, this one. one! That's right! It fits perfectly! Let's go! And so, the engineers continued on their way to Machu Picchu to get the baby llamas to their mamas. Now we're really moving! Yep, and no sign of you-know-who. It's you know who! Go faster! Quick! Switch tracks! Wowzers! This is a really steep hill! He's still right behind us! Wait! Why is he slowing down? Why are we slowing down? Oh no! Drama. <laughs> I didn't mean to scare anybody. <laughs> then why are you chasing us? <laughs> because I just wanted to help you up the mountain. You did? Yeah, I'm the Machu Picchu Choo Choo. Fantastico! And so, the Machu Picchu Choo Choo pushed them all the way to the top of the mountain. We made it! <laughs> Thank you, Machu Picchu Choo Choo! <laughs> Wait a minute, do you hear that? Sounds like popcorn popping. That silo is filled up to the top with corn. And it's popping! It smells delicious! to bring Wooly back? I sure hope so. Here, Scout! <coughs> We're over here! I think they're lost! <coughs> what are you doing, boy? What's he doing? He's taking it with him so 
we can find the way back. This is so exciting. Be careful, Bubble Puppy. We just ran out of gas. I guess I should have filled it up before we left. Where's that monkey? What's going on? Mr. Grouper, I think those cars are honking at us. Uh oh, we're causing a traffic jam. Oh boy, if we don't get out of the way, then nobody can go to the amusement parking lot. Don't worry, Mr. Grouper. We know a place where we can get gas for your car. You do? Let's help Mr. Grouper find the place that fills cars with gas. Is it the supermarket, the train station, or the gas station? The gas station! Right! You can fill your car with gas at the gas station. Let's call Mr. Petrol. Yeah! Okay! Gas station. Hello, Mr. Petrol. Mr. Grouper, how you doing? Well, we just ran out of gas down the street from you. Say no more, Mr. Grouper. I'll bring you some right away. Thank you. Fill her up. Well, that was speedy. This will only take a second. Just another minute, folks. All right, Mr. Grouper, that should do it. Hooray! Materials are what you use to make things out of. Let's think about what kind of materials you can build things out of. The construction workers were building a house out of... Wood! Wow, that's a great material. People make houses out of wood all the time. And chimneys are made out of... Bricks! Yep, bricks are strong. Well, what about windows? Windows are made out of... Glass. That's right. You need strong materials to build a building. I've been outside all day long. I want a cozy place where I can sing this song. A place where I'll reside. I want to be inside. So build me a building. Yeah. Glass for the windows, a rug on the floor. Bricks for the chimney, a big wooden door. I'll even take a playroom or two. You know. Ask 
your parents to subscribe to Nick Jr.'s Bubble Guppies YouTube channel for new videos every week. And watch full episodes on the Nickelodeon and Nick Jr. channel.